uh, the Chamber's sole purpose is to promote and support business in the goldfields. We go about that by, by lobbying uh, key stakeholders, by, um, by looking at what the key issues are in terms of business in the goldfields, and going about our business by influencing those decision makers to make sure that the goldfields business community is looked after. Most of the services that the Chamber of Commerce provides are uh, communicating with members, finding out what members want, and then if they need something, providing solutions. Sometimes you feel you're alone and uh, you're very small in a remote area, and uh, the, the network of the Chamber uh, has an, an amazing ability to lobby uh, not only large organisations on your behalf and uh, get a, a voice out there uh, as a common voice, but also to uh, state and federal government. Uh, there's, there's often a misconception that a Chamber of Commerce is, is part of government, is funded by government, but in fact nothing could be further than the, from the truth. I became a member of the Chamber just when I started in my business uh, with the idea of support because one person on their own isn't able to do much and so the Chamber gave me a support network. I feel the Chamber does appeal to all ages, whether you're a young business person or an old business person, um, the Chamber has a wealth of information and, and resource available to all people in business and um, should definitely be taking advantage of those. Um, they point you in the right direction, they help out immensely with um, any issues that you... Us as a, uh, a repair shop didn't really know the answers to when we first started. But our business, being a member of the Chamber, is extremely valuable. Um, we found that um, it's enabled us ample networking opportunities, it really does allow you to mix with hundreds of businesses in the local region that um, if you weren't a me member of the Chamber, you'd find it extremely difficult to meet as many businesses as, as we do. So we, we hold um, just about every month business after hours function, which is just a great networking opportunity for business members uh, to get together, to socialise and also to form relationships. And I can tell you what, relationships is how you do business. Well, it's been really handy for us to have the um the backup of the chamber as far as being able to ask questions about what's going on in the in industries various industries and um yeah it's just been a very approachable um body of information the local chamber here is very beneficial for um Calgary boulder i think it's quite unique in in what they do um even though we were we are still a member of the state chamber of commerce and industry the local chamber has a really great vibe um, great networking capabilities. The Chamber does lots of things in the community and this is perhaps something that maybe people don't really realise. Um, the Spring Festival for example, St Barbara's Day Parade, they're two big things that we get involved in. In addition of course to the Business and Employee of the Year Awards. What's Down the Track is such a big event as well. Um, we hold that obviously once a year where we get some very, very influential people together in the same room at the same time and actually promote uh, what they're up to and what their business are up to to the wider community. The Chamber is, I feel, is extremely beneficial to the, to the city. Um, what we found, and especially recently, they've just released the, I think it was the economy update. Um, yeah, so we're just finding that, just knowing a little bit more about what's happening in our region as opposed to not being a member of the Chamber obviously gives us um, a lot more insight into what's going well, what's not, not going so well. The Chamber of Commerce directory is a, is a very good and um, accurate piece of information. And the Chamber directory is a highly effective way of advertising because of its reach into every home and every business. The process of placing an ad in the directory was very, very simple. The consumer wants a directory that's got everything. That directory's got everything. I think that the Chamber is quite good. I think that if you're a business owner, you should be involved. That can give you a heap of information, whether it's relevant to your business or not, and you'd be surprised at how much is almost like a bit of a flow-on effect. So um, you can be, um, you can go to business after hours and find things out word of mouth, or you can be involved with the newsletters. You get to have a say. The council rely on the Chamber for information. So if you want to be part of the decision-making processes as such, then you need to be on the member of you need to be on the chamber of commerce